that are coming up to the stage, everyone give a big round of applause to Jake Arnold. Woo! Got it. Got it, bro. Hi, what's up? That was wrong. Hey, yeah. 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 it's started that's a Facebook good. page. Y'all should oh, check it out. Good. It's uh, how to play really chick good. with your tiny dick. I was really nice. Me and about four million Asian fellers down there. <laughs> We, uh, I think they got some damn good clues on what to do, but it's in Mandarin. That's <laughs> about that. I uh, got out of a horrible relationship <laughs> about ten years ago. We were all gathered around and we were talking to a bunch of couples about how we, first time we made love and it came to my girlfriend's time and she, uh, she said, well, he just got done with the Boston Marathon, and I said, no. May have not been me on that one. Right? <laughs> Let's take another shot at that. Well, he just got this prosthetic leg, and I was getting treated for chlamydia at the clinic. <laughs> I said, yeah, once again, <clears throat> both legs here. We're going to go there. He said, oh, I got it again. This is getting embarrassing. I said, yeah, you think it is for you. Uh, she said, well, uh, he, uh, he just got done giving me my third abortion there at Wichita at the clinic. And, and I said, once again, babe, I'm going to go and shut you down right there. Sounds like a killer relationship, but I don't think that was me either. <laughs> I, uh, she, uh, I got, ended up having two kids with her, and that makes for a romantic story to start out with. We, uh, she had C-section, and that's a pretty cool deal there. Um, but now that we're split up, I'm really pulling that she would have had them sons of bitches all natural. <laughs> Weighing about 50 pounds, sideways, with claws the size of a wolverine, ripping that son of a bitch up the whole way out. <laughs> she telling me, she telling me with stuff like the It's Funny How, and her it's funny how and my it's funny how were two different things. Mine usually ended with me laughing my ass off and hers usually ended with me but answering a bunch of damn questions. She'd say stuff like, man, it's awful funny how you'll sit there and eat that medium rare steak, sopping up all the blood with a piece of bread, but you will not touch me on that time of the month. <laughs> I said, well, if you're gonna go ahead and compare pussy to steak, I got a couple different things I wanna run by you. <laughs> Number one, Ben, that uh, if you want me to heat that son of a bitch up to 135 degrees, throw some grill marks on it, and end it up with some garlic salt, they could make it along a little better. <laughs> But uh, as it turns out there, that ain't gonna happen, I don't think. But you have got me thinking that maybe we got an untapped resource on beef that we didn't know about, like pussy burgers. You know, and uh, you know, you cook it up a pussy burger there for all your buddies, and they say, God dang, man, how in the hell do you keep these sons of bitches so moist? Boy, you gotta rub them just right, buddy. Y'all have an awesome night.